the refit bridge. Yeah, look at that. I wouldn't know the difference in it, to be honest. Right, we're going to start our X4 reemergence run, including the Star Trek mod. Um, we're going to go in here. And I'm going to show you. Apologize for attack is on just because I had it on. Extended conversation menu. Extra game options. The OTAS ship pack, which is part of X4 Remergence. Do the friendly fire tweaks on. The BRO, which needs this asset bundle now, so remember that. The Star Trek ship pack. Uh, mod support APIs. And that is it. That is all that's on. So far. Although, wait. Ship variation pack, that. I'm pretty sure that works with VRO, right? Or do I need a different version of that? Hmm. Leave it off for now, but that is a possibility to be turned on. And that's about it. Uh, that was the wrong thing. We're going in here. <clears throat> Layer. I'll do. Starting balance is that much. We are going to have better thrusters. That's it there. Uh, that's fine. Uh, that's fine. That's that. Now. So, this thing here, the manual torpedo launcher, is the one that acts like a, an energy weapon with unlimited ammo. This one has ammo. <clears throat> and acts like a standard missile launcher. And then we have two disruptors. And that is us. So I need to actually load up the torpedoes. We can go with the D11. Mm, or we can go with the Zale class. And then this is the the what's the DK2? Oh, that's the standard. Okay, that's the standard. And then there's the plasma launcher. I think we'll go with the photon launcher. Then we have disruptors. As two turrets, I believe are there. And has the forward firing weapons. <clears throat> Here's a hundred torpedo. Oh, and I suppose it has. Yeah, okay. Give <laughs> it one cargo drone. Because why not? Yeah, we're going to go with this to start with. It's on the Remergence map, so um, it's very different. We're not going to have any other property. So you can see it's uh, this is a much different map. I do not know it. There's going to be a lot of exploration. Yeah. 
We'll leave all this as is. Hmm. Do we want this? No, I, I don't think I want the, the HQ or anything like that. We'll leave everything as is. But we are going to be operating Omulin and Cleon ships. So we'll use this as a command ship. We'll build up a fleet of like a uh, bird of prey and stuff. So we'll be working with the split. The split and the parrot. <clears throat> obvious goal is right destroy the uh, federation which is technically the argon so even though we're starting in argon space because i don't know the map all right get the important stuff done You know, this is apparently effective. Fine, additional gates. There, there, there. Um, I don't know if that matters now because we're on a different map. All right, we've got to go explore because we need to find um, the territory. <laughs> We have 10,000 credits. Jump gate unknown. Entering system, second contact. over that way. Wait, what was our cargo drone doing? Jump gate, unknown sector. Drill, mineral. Jump gate, unknown sector.
it's going to be a lot of mapping out at the beginning. See what we can find. We want to work with either the split or the paranid. But we do want to get on good terms with the split and buy a bird of prey. Which is going to take us a while because we're going to need the rep. And we're going to need them not to be absolutely destroyed. Right, so at the moment we've gone from Argon Prime to the contact back into Black Old Sun. Trying to go around the circle. I didn't do a ping in Argon Prime, which I should have. There's a gate. Kind of curious how many of these ships are the AI going to build? Breakers. Oh. Entering system windfall. <laughs> of course. Is all the same. Come on, don't make this difficult, Crimson. You're the one who broke the rules. Uh -oh. Trying to make a living here. Okay, one last time. No illegal wares. What does illegal even mean in these parts? You're just taking whatever you want. Mining. We're not taking anything that isn't already ours. We weren't supposed to get this far in the first place. How important this is to me. It's all I have left. My family is starving. Of course I know that, idiot. It's how the business is run. Our lives are all just business. And you've made a miscalculation. Now drop your cargo. <laughs> no. Jump gate, unknown sector. Entering system, commence reckoning. 
That's it, no. We don't need to go here. We'll come back here at another time. We do not need to be here, Jesus. Entering system, windfall. That's an interesting system. <clears throat> Wait, really? None get in the fall through cat row uh, nearby riptide raider smuggler around the rear. So initially calm and deserted, the piece was abruptly shattered by the appearance of a massive cat swarm. Yes. Hey, Spectre. Hey, Jonathan, is it going? Uh, CAC sector. New ship or ships? Uh, yes, this is the Star Trek mod. But also with um, the Remergence mod, which adds its own ships. We are starting out with a Romulan Bird of Prey. We're going to try and get some beyond ships. So again, like I've said, I'll say it a few more times. This completely redoes the map. Realigns all the gates, adds in new sectors. So I have no idea where I'm going. There is a map available for it, but I don't want to look at it. <clears throat> These models are just awesome, though. Look at that detailing. Last jump is why we always slow down before we go through the gate. Entering system. Allergies joy. Allergies joy. Hmm. They do a super jump, they do. They really do. Gonna be like our command ship, and then the bird of prey are gonna be our workhorses for the moment. I think when we get them, we haven't even found a space we want to operate in yet. I probably will be adding in the ship variation expansion, probably the weapon variation expansion, even though it's not going to affect most of the ships we're using. I'll see if they're up to date, and that's probably going to be about it, unless people have recommendations. Entering system, silent witness. All right. over there. That's hardly going back to where we were. No. Yes, yeah, Silent Witness is all the way down here now instead of being up here. There's Argon and Teladi Fleet. I think this is going to be refreshing for me to do X4 when I don't know where I'm going and stuff. 
hopefully uh, people enjoy watching it as well. Watch, watch this. This is a series. <clears throat> that is a CAC installation, is it? Or is that the gates? It's the gates. Another gate over there. And again, we can't presume that they lead to where they used to lead to. Although this one should. Does. I wonder is it still cut off system or a one gate system? I want to see if that other gate leads to um, See where this leads. Oh, okay. Aragon Prime. Gotcha. So we've done the loop. Let's go somewhere else. It's a parrot. That's a lot of parrot, is it? No oh, cack. Hmm. The hypergate over there probably leads to where it used to lead to. And then is there still a gate out this way? The 
get down there. Wait, what? Unknown object. All right, we get over there. What did I fly past? How's it going? I'm fantastic considering it's three o'clock in the morning and I decided to start a new X4 run. Spotted a tracker mine from that far. I know Star Wars isn't going anywhere, don't worry about that. No, this is um the Star Trek ship pack which adds six ships now. Six bull ships and a and a shuttle. Along with um, X4 Remergence, which is a brand new map, added sectors, added uh, ships, and such like that. Send. Okay. I was going to say maybe we're close to split space, but maybe it makes no difference. <laughs> or Paran in space, or any, any space other than Nargon, where everyone's going that way. Uh, this is the only Romulan ship. The Katinga and the Bird of Prey are in for the Klingons. And then the Excelsior, the Constitution 2. And the uh, Shangri-La. These ships are all from the motion picture era. And uh, the mod is on Nexus. Uh, most of the other ships have an interior. Most of the Federation ships have full... A full bridge interior. He's working on the bird of prey interior. Celsius was the first one added. Oh, that's right. We're minus 15 with the split. Mm. Even better. I always thought he should start getting shot there. Alright, we are now in split space. Now we've got to start working on our reps. We need to get missions and such. We're gonna bounce around to stations. Probably have to shoot a few mines. If we, can we get missions at minus fifteen? Because uh, shooting criminal traffic in this is gonna be uh, risky. 
<laughs> hey, Money Monkeys Jedi in this mod? Uh, well, no, because this is not the Star Wars mod. <laughs> Fly a satellite at the that position. If I had a satellite. Not quite as many monkeys. Thank you again for the sub. They're 22 months in a row. You madman. Ooh, do we have parents next door as well? Hold on now, this could be handy. <laughs> no worries, Vector, every good one. I, I know that feeling. Yeah, so we're just starting out with the newest ship in the Star Trek mod, which is the Romulan Warbird, the Azel class. And then we're going to be using um, the Klingon Bird of Prey, which I can't show you that they sell, but they sell it. Ah, suppress enemy presence. Oh, water by. Uh, we do need to go into the right area, so let's do that. Hmm. Uh, the motion picture is what the mod is focusing on, I believe. Motion pictures. Can you break asteroids? Yes, you can. What's your unknown ship? No Dominion Heresy. <laughs> I like the uh, Dominion attack ship for what it is, but. I like th I like their designs in general, but uh, I'm very much a Dideridex and Bird of Prey person. Oh yeah, we'll openly attack Antigone. Stop running away. Because here's the thing I, I have no idea where Antigone's space is now. Could be a terrible idea. about the Cardassian ships that you loved? Well, look, can't all be right. <laughs> Borg tactical cube against an Excelsior. I know what you said, yeah. Wait, what did I say? Ooh, that's a larger ship. What, what is that? It's a destroyer. I don't think I can take on a destroyer. He doesn't seem to have support ships. What did I say, Excelsior? Right, right. 
3 a.m. Come on. Do anything if you believe in yourself. Oh well. Um. Not the hound. No. We can take on a hound. Especially if he's being attacked by other people. Gotta see what these torpedoes are like. And they're green, I love it. Yeah, I'm not in, I don't mind the Federation ships. I just uh, much prefer Romulan and Sovereign is nice looking, yeah. Hey. First kill. Gotta go Ferengi. <clears throat> Technically the Ferengi have some pretty strong ships. Danger. No, I'm like a Burrell and the Derdicks. I do love the Akira. <clears throat> particular in my ships. these weapons. The Burrell maybe, but... Sorry, the D11, I keep calling it the Burrell, it's not.
like a modern Miranda. <laughs> I think the Defiant is one of the generation of ships that were built for war, so yeah, I like the simple compact design. So yeah, I like the... Oh man, the names are all escaping me now. Basically, I had, a, I had a bunch of um, ships in Star Trek Online. Who are we doing this mission for, by the way? It is for Zyarth, okay. I had considered starting with the OTAS battleship, but uh, it's it's very strong. So we haven't been through any of these, so we'll jump into these now. Jump gate, unknown sector. We'll pop back in and go to the other ones, and then we'll be doing the patrol as we do that. Much better to start off with nothing. But I want to start off with something. Like, the bird of prey would be cool, but it's only a corvette. Like we will be using the bird of prey a lot more than this when we get it. This is a little bit more cargo capacity. So like we can go in here and we haven't seen that ship yet, so we can't look at that. Oh. Turrets are on defend. Say so shoot missiles first. Again, we have uh, a hit there. Those two turrets, one side of, on each side of the tail there. There are only turrets. This money monkeys, have a good one. Thank you again for the resub, dude. Ooh, there's Xenon in here. Alright, we'll go back and check the other gate. I love the shots of the bird of prey and these nine wolf packs. Oh, that's exactly what we're going to be doing. And I, uh, I did a test run of the mod when they added the bird of prey, and it is pretty awesome to have like a couple of bird of prey flanking you, and then give them the order to attack.
Which is the plan. We'll have the pair of them with us at all times. When we can afford it. And then we'll be getting Katingas and with Bird of Prey escorts. Oh, Lord Holax. Your wings have three positions. <laughs> so in in flight mode, their wings are flat. Entering wretched skies well. In combat mode, their wings fold down, and then when they land, the wings fold up. Oh, this is empty space. Okay, this is um, there's potential for us. Sunlight and methane. Yeah, we could make it work. We take some damage. We damaged. I know I'm personally damaged, but we did. We took 800 hull points of damage. There is... I can see the superhighways over there. Go back and finish this mission. Hey, Stormwind. Are you hopes that the Constellation class... I don't know that. I already know what to see it, but I don't know it off the top of my head. Uh, Connie is a constitution class. Constellation has the, the vertical engines, right? As in one above the saucer and one below the saucer. Or two above and two below. Jump back into Wretched Skies here and want to do a ping. Discoverer Sentinel. Let's see, I can't see a gate over that side. There's another mission. Mine disposals, yes, we'll do that. Oh, they're right behind us. Isn't that handy? Now we just have to hit them. Are 
I do hope at some point he gives the like the Klingon getting a, a beam, although did they ever get a beam weapon in the motion pictures? It's very hard to to lock the um, disruptors onto small targets. They they target it, but it doesn't mean you're going to hit it at all. You can see where they're going there. It's the downside of these ships compared to the uh, the um, Federation ships that have beam weapons. Why does he have an exclamation mark? Hmm. I don't want to talk to him. So it's like an Akira of the, the era. Attack him, but I'll lose rep with the Paranid. And you don't get away from us anyway. Alright, so we found a bit of split space. I need to find if this goes anywhere. We need to pop in here and uh, see if there's anything over here. You want an AB class? Don't know what that is. The um, Shangri-La has a bunch of torpedo launchers, and I don't know if we've even seen one yet. No. No, we must have passed by a Titan. Alright, Lord Holax, have a good one. 
Which makes you mix of um kind of Kieran and Nebula. All right. Try these for the uh, parent. We did lose a bit of rep with them, so we'll we'll do this little mission while we're waiting. A lot of mines, buddy. I did notice while we were fighting the Hound that um, the Disruptors like to reset off of target when you move around so you know what the way they default to a certain position like that. That will be an issue. So you've got to fire off a volley. There we go. We didn't gain that much reputation at all. Did make a bunch of money though. They want to find the um, Parnage Shipyard. See how much of these are going to cost. Just for the hull. Then I think the bird of prayer, like a couple of million. But not too expensive. But we're probably gonna have to get the license. going on at the gate. What is that weapon? is a bomber. It's one of the new ships. Right, there's bombers and this new weapons and everything. Pretty sure that is its buster bomb launcher or something like that. Play it this way a little bit. Oh yeah, there, there's an accelerator right there. thinking I didn't even go in and look at any of the blueprints that we have so we probably don't even have solar panel blueprints or anything like that
I love the front end on this. Hey, frog bones. This is so cool. But I, I love that. Uh, the one that started making a Star Trek mod. I've wanted a Star Trek mod next four for so long. To um, jump through all these gates and come back into this system. Yeah, the mod author has done a fantastic job. Oh, I need to put in the rooms mod. Covered capital, that's a new system. The split at war with the Taladi as well. Was that the shipyard? The shipyard over there, I think. Unless it's just a repair bay or. Oh, it's just the solar panel. D don't mind me. Don't mind me at all. Those weapons are very loud. <laughs> How did he jump in behind us without us seeing him? the debris. I think that was a great little addition in the updates. That little bit of debris coming off the ships. Find silicon. Alright, excellent. So we have a bunch of the uh, split territory here, which is great. Gonna be where we're operating out of.
Hey, Tritozzi. Wrong bird of prey. Oh, we're good. We're starting with this. We're going to be using both types. So technically, the Bird of Prey is supposed to be a Romulan design. Yeah, Burrell. Seems like there's going to be a bunch of xenon activity here. Elephant. Oh, there's the equipment dock. That's a xenon sector. <clears throat> Giving away a Grand Nagus Marauder. What do you have to do for it, though? Oh, just log in and claim it? Really? I'll be doing that after the stream. Wait, why is there a gold banner on my Discord? Thank you, Discord. If anyone in my Discord is getting suspicious DMs, let me know. And I will ban accordingly. Yeah, right, this is the Xenon system, but the Splitter active. Get all these stations on our radar. Do they have any missions we want to take them? I need to get this wrap up. Thank you. 
chunky station compared to the rest of them. Hmm. I'm gonna try this, but... We are not the best ship to engage the CAC. We just won't be able to hit them. Flight to family newt, which means it's probably connected to this system. Uh, you also get on the ship, its trace and consoles were also buffed for the street. Oh, cool. Yeah, I'll definitely have a look at that. Free ship, why not, right? I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this mission with this ship because of accuracy. Comes with gold plating too. Of course it does. But not gold plated latinum. Okay, sweet. There's a like a good-sized split system here. I don't know how well I'm going to be able to protect him. An LX. That's not the target, but... Yeah, that's a bummer. <laughs> that hurt. There they are. Wings guard. Forager. We're not doing this mission, by the way. Although, if he can get there and they attack us, cool. Tractor beam. Are we 
you. Oh, hi. My guns are overheated. Take a torpedo. Torpedo missed. Need a new character slot for a Ferengi character. <laughs> How many characters have you got now? Birds are doing their job firing at the enemy. Our guns are. Whatever the default cap for characters is. Okay, I have no idea what that is. <laughs> right, I think the torpedo hit finally. In range of station now. Wings guard. See the wall of blue flak plasma turrets. You can buy forty four more slots. Get us a bunch of um oof, a flag fire. Five guard. Bunch of rep hopefully. It was two, was it? Jesus. Well, yeah, the game has grown a lot, though, in fairness. Especially if you're into that IP. Thank you. Yeah, I'm not a huge MMO person, but I get a lot out of that game. There we go, we're at zero, that's fantastic. That is actually great, because that means we can go here. Let's say, hey, how much is it gonna cost me? Oh, never mind, we don't need a license. 1.4 million. We need the license for the disruptors. Are you going to tell me which license I need? Who needs guns ramming speed? Jump rate unknown sector. Fair, but I wouldn't mind some guns. Ooh. 
But that's okay. We only have to get plus ten with them and maybe get them. Kind of way. Indeed. <clears throat> we definitely wouldn't have a shielded cargo hold in this thing. to build a station anyway. Do a solar power plant. Get things running. If I can. I'm gonna need money for the license. Not the license, but the um the building fee, whatever that's called. I don't know if there is anything down this way, but we'll have a look. There's a gate. So we can destroy mines or destroy mines. We've destroyed enough mines. Entering system, Biox Dominion. I completely stopped it. Water shorts to doing arms race. Okay. Apologies, I'm about to rotate across the sun.
And again. Gotta see where this gate goes. This is the, basically the whole of the other uh, the original split systems are now down here. Cool. Who's the enemy? Oh, it's the Argon. We're about to get involved in that fight when we come back in. So this is the front line. It is. They're operating it. Yeah, they, they look so cool just flying around. Now that he has the AI using him, that's fantastic. You know what we're going to do? Straight off the bat. We're now at war with the Aragon. <clears throat> we're technically the Federation. shoot that so I can steal its stuff. Kind of cool if we start coming up against the Excelsior and stuff like that. I don't know how how regular they're gonna be. That ah, that was not me.
But we picked up Claytronics. That's actually pretty sweet. Uh, da, 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 da. Do I take station charts? I don't think we can do that right now. Do 75 Claytronics. We can get rid of them real quick. Where are we? We're down here. Oh, we'd have to go all that way. Okay, well, we'll hold on to them for now. I'm going to grab this loot over here. That means the Paranid are going to be using this ship in their fleets. And then all of the Federation things will be in the um, Aragon and, and Antigone fleets. That's a bunch of stuff for us. And a bunch of stations over here that we need to get on our radar. Got another trade center. That would be fantastic. like it. Back to that build storage and take some more claytronics. You can see that this ship is not huge. It's a cargo drone. Downside, we're going to be facing directly into the sun. Cobra. Build storage. We do two or three runs of this.
That'll help pay for the um, bird of prey. Four crystal bits. I don't have any unstable crystals. I need eleven crystal bits. Okay. Fifty grand. at zero though. Build storage. I'll right, we'll do one more run of this. Yeah, sorry, hold on one second. Spammers in the Discord. Alright, let's go get rid of these and then we'll go do other stuff. Check that gate as well, don't we?
successfully docked. Welcome. Hostile satellite is not on my radar. Station down there, that's cool. All right. Gate over there. Another gate over there that will lead back into here. Cool. Which means we want to see where this one goes. Yeah, as you can see, like completely different map layer. It's gonna get interesting. Oh, Xenon. Okay. That tractor beam. Jump gate, unknown sector. Don't know what was going on with the camera. It's just that that issue that uh, it has when it's targeting something. Entering system, Matrix. 
Numbered 598. Damn, look at all the wrecks. in our only ship. A bunch of stations over there. The gate is over there as well. Very spread out systems. Shooting at <clears throat> scale plate marauder, and you have. I knew I could count on you. I knew I could count on you. Bunch of stuff. Good idea. Being fired on by a, uh, <laughs> another ship, and you're still pirating. Crap. 
We're not supposed to have stormtroopers. Come on, guns. Let's go explore, uh, explore patrol. It's the patrol in the system that is the front line for the uh, Akron War, so we should. Get a bunch of stuff. Uh, targets and rep and so on. Be upside down. Might be upside down. Saboteur. Carefully drop the mind. Torpedo swung back around and got him. Right, I'm gonna head over towards this gate, which is over here. Jump gate somewhere. Power. We know there's a small battle group over here. Thanks for your help. Oh, split. I didn't get out of this ship at any point, did I? Looks like it reset the camera.
Ryan keeps going through the gates. Looks like there was a minefield being erected on the other side there, if you did notice all the little question marks in a row. Oh my god, it's an excels here. Holy crap. Not expecting that. Um, I thought he died already. Thank you. 